And it also is some, talk, some good news this morning out of Shelby County. We want to thank our viewer, Joel Dixon, for sharing this story with us. Art students at Shelby County High School are helping disadvantaged children overseas to document their lives. CBS 42 News reporter Ariana Garza shows us how. Each face tells a story. A story of a life so far removed from the lives of these art students at Shelby County High School. It's hard in today's day and age to know how to be good. And so this program is just like, hey, here's a really easy way to be good, and those kids just jump at it. Art teacher Michelle Branson guides her students' brushstrokes every day, but the memory project stands out. These students receive a photo of an underprivileged child and paint a new portrait to send back. There's just joy when the kids get the portraits, because who doesn't want a picture of themselves? It's really awesome to think that somebody worked really hard on making you a special present and that it crossed oceans to get to you. Sophomore Madison Smith received a photo of a seven-year-old girl. What do you want her to feel when she gets this portrait of her? I just want her to like feel happy. At a time when most communication is done through a smartphone, these students are forming a universal language through their artwork. We're all humans. We all want the same things. We all want kids to be happy. We all want kids to have a personal history. It makes me feel very grateful that we actually are like one of the schools that actually get to give to other people. Once the project is complete, the children send back a video showing their reactions to the portraits. Thank you so much for your hard work. It means a lot to these children. This video shows the Syrian refugees who benefited from this program last year. Ariana Garza, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on. Well, the school will send this year's portraits back to Russia in the spring, and the students will also include photos of themselves. Yeah, you know, not only am I amazed by what they do and how they're helping kids around the world, but also amazed at their artwork. Absolutely, and they said they took you know, a month or more on mm -hmm. some of these, really put the time in, and it shows. Yeah, good stuff, guys. Well, tell us about some other good news stories happening in your neighborhood. It could be a positive program or someone you know doing something good for others. Just send us an email to goodnews at cbs42.com. You can also inbox us on our social media pages. Well, I've got to say they've really stepped up from a pen pal with the neighboring elementary yes. school. <laughs> Next level. Yes. It is. That story really warmed our hearts, yes. but you really need to wrap up warm today on a cold one on this Wednesday. Can I just interject here real quick? Sure. Die Hard is not a Christmas movie. <laughs>